Hey guys, what's going on? It's Twintuitive717. I am back with another reading, guys, hanging out with Mega Good Vibes, my little sweet sidekick, and we are on to do messages from the Divine Masculines, okay? I'm going to dive right in, universe. You know who is tuning in for the readings. Please provide clarity on their journey. What's going on with the Divine Masculine Collective? Okay, so I have a message for those of you in karmic situations, okay? So... Your masculine wants you to know that their partner is holding on tightly ever since you and them connected, okay? And I'm feeling like the connection between you and your masculine, it just happened. It was kind of like this whole love at first sight. It's something that you cannot control and I feel like neither can your masculine. Um, I do feel that their partner found out about you because of this, like I'm hearing fascination with you or your energy, okay? But someone knows I feel like they want to communicate this to you. This could be something that you already know or you can sense or you can pick up on. You can feel it. Um, but it's just a confirmation that's coming through in this reading, okay? Let's find out what you guys are learning about this connection. Like everyone involved. Um, what does this whole connection between you and your masculine mean? Okay, so we have Mercury messages, travel, communication, okay? I feel that with travel and communication coming in, this person needs to get to you. I don't know if you guys are at a distance and maybe you observe one another through social media, but you can feel your person's energy very strongly. Um, again, it doesn't matter how you two met, it just, like you clicked, you clicked, your heart can't help what it is you feel. I feel like that is a, a clear message here that's coming through. Even with the energy of, of um, Mercury, I'm getting it like I'm hearing it need, I'm seeing the words it needs to be said. Okay, it needs to be said. So I'm not sure if someone's come across like a conversation or like, I don't know, like I'm seeing... I'm seeing something about messages, okay? So I don't know if you two have connected online or something's been said, but someone knows the truth about how this person feels for you. And this energy is telling me like it's clear. The communication that has been had or the communication that's been said between two people, it's clear how you two feel for one another. And someone's holding on tightly to this person this karmic person could feel very threatened by your energy. They could be looking you up a lot on social media. I'm seeing like very curious about you. They could be in a, a just a bit of a curious energy, but it's taking them to a place of, of insecurity, which is why they're holding on to this person very tightly, okay? But I feel like this is what this person wants to communicate to you, this person that feels like your divine counterpart. Again, ever since you two connected, it's a very strong connection, so much to the point where this person has communicated that to you or you two have revealed deeper feelings for one another. Okay, we have forming structure and solid foundation. Someone knows that this connection between you two is legitimate. Like I'm also hearing too, this person that's been with this Divine Masculine, they've been so, so sure of their connection. But I feel like if for the first time ever, it's this like awful feeling of someone coming through and providing this divine masculine with even more structure and like a more of a solid foundation. Okay, I'm also hearing too, there's a lot that's coming up now in this connection or it will be coming up um, where there's going to be a bit of instability or you're going to see where the instability lies or someone's not really all that happy and it wasn't until the connection with you that they started communicating that more or standing up for themselves but I feel like the more they start piecing things together or realizing that their heart is drawn to someone else and maybe they're questioning the path that they're currently on okay let me tell you guys what I'm feeling I'm feeling a divine masculine who is who has been with someone for a really long time and now they're starting to realize like what if what if there's another path for me? Like, what if this is the end of this chapter and I'm meant to experience something else? But the person they're with is like, no, you're going to be with me for the rest of your life. But I feel like your masculine is like open and 
opening up their eyes, opening up their heart, opening up their perspective, um, and really questioning as to whether or not they're currently happy or whether they want more for themselves, whether they want more of a solid foundation. It could be that the connection that they've been in with this person is more how this person wants a relationship to be, but I don't feel like your masculine feels heard. But with you, they feel seen, they feel heard, they feel understood, they feel loved. They feel desired. Ooh. Okay, what else is your masculine going through while they're having all of these thoughts about this person that they're with? What are they experiencing? What are they opening up their eyes to? What is your masculine opening up their eyes to? <laughs> I feel like a lot. <laughs> There's a lot. I'll take what came at the top and at the bottom of this pile. Okay, at the bottom we have divine timing and trust and at the top we have epiphany and we have breakthrough so I feel like they're moving out of something and it's going to take a lot of trust and it's going to take a lot of time for I'm hearing like a tower to fall like it's not like the tower is just gonna go boom it's down I feel like there's going to be cracks in the structure and I think we even had the word structure come out on this one it could be like this this formation is falling down so that something else can be rebuilt in more truth or in more passion and love. I feel like that's the epiphany that many of your masculines are having. That's that breakthrough I was talking about where they're stopping and they're like, wait a second. Like, could there be another path? Like, could there be another chapter of my life? Because I feel like a lot of your masculines are like, why would I have met you? Why do you still stay on my mind? It's like, why as the days go by do I feel more and more passionate about you? Let's uh, let's get a message from the romance angels to see how they're feeling in their heart space. And then I'll see what they think about when they get to this place of desire, okay? It's like desire is when you really can't get someone out of your mind. It's past the point of attraction. Like it's just like, no, like I think about this person on my, <laughs> on my uh, time off. <laughs> like when I zone out, when I have a minute or two, I think about this person. I think about them centrally. I think about what I would do to them, you know? We have forgiving and learning coming up, okay? So as you release and heal the past, you experience more love in your present moments. Oof, that's crazy, guys. I think it goes hand in hand with this message. This might be something that your masculine's wanting to communicate to this person that they're with is like, you know what, it's time to let this go. And I feel like this person that they're with is like, whoa, 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 like where, where is all of this coming from? Just because, you know, you have this connection with this person and I feel like your masculine's like, no, it's not that. It's just ever since I met them, I can finally stand up and feel good about standing up for the things I haven't been happy about. I feel like a lot of your masculines have tried to maybe exit the situation in the past, but this person was just like, no, only my emotions need to be heard. Only, it only matters how I feel. You know, I'm going to throw a bunch of tears at you. I'm going to make myself seem like a victim. And then your masculines used to get like silenced in this way. And I feel like many of them are ready to let go of that. I feel like many of them want to let go of the past so that more love can enter because they can't get over how they feel about you and the more passionate they feel about you the more they're pulling away from this person and unfortunately what's happening is like this person is holding on to them so the more they're drawn to you and letting go of this person the more this person is drawn to them and many of you can see that happening on your journeys um how else is this masculine doing towards you and the connection Okay, so we have soulmate coming up. Okay, so yes, this is your soulmate, or I feel like in this case, twin flame. Yes, this is someone who is, I feel like meant to enter your life now at this point. Um, and there's no running from it as well. I feel like that's what a lot of your masculines are seeing and learning. And so is this other person that's in their life. Like a lot of, a lot of the times this person clings to them because they, they can genuinely feel your ma the masculine's energy as well where I feel like a lot of your masculines feel at peace or like just the way that they are, they're standing for something bigger or stronger. Like it's almost like this connection here means a lot <laughs> to your divine masculines to the point where it's like their energy is like shifting or changing with this person and it's making this person cling to them. Um, let's find out about what's in your masculines 
just fantasies for you, okay? Just how they feel about you on a sensual level, on an intimate level. What do they want to communicate in that area? I feel like that's dying to come out. How do they see you at this time? Just in the sense where they desire you. Oh, that's way too many. Let's get what's at the top of the pile and what's at the bottom. Oh my goodness, look at these combination of cards. <laughs> Okay, so I feel like this is representing a new love or someone that they feel very passionate towards. They want to run to you. They want to come to you. This shows me two lovers meeting in secret. The connection could be a secret. Again, I'm feeling like someone found out through some type of communication or messages that the connection between you two is a lot deeper than just an attraction. There is deep passion there. There is desire. I can't stop thinking about you. I can't get you off my mind. Even when you're not around, you're here with me, okay? And the scissors here in this um, image here, it's representing that it's time to break free from some type of routine. Because four represents that stability um, that came out, right? Because we had solid foundation. But I feel like your masculine has stability with someone that they're with. But when it feels too stable, it's like their back's against the wall. I feel like they feel too much of this person's energy this person the way they're pointing and kind of um holding their hand up towards this divine masculine they could be very pushy they could be very bossy again i'm seeing someone who only cares about their emotions and many of your masculines they don't feel attracted to this person anymore because of their fixation on just themselves their own feelings i feel like when you came in you desire this masculine, you make them feel sexy, you make them feel appreciated, you make them feel, again, desired, right? It's like their animalistic side just comes out around you because you're, you're, you're matching that passion. I feel like a lot of your masculines are genuinely passionate about life. They're passionate about love and romance, but someone has come into their life and really kind of sucked that out all of them. Like, it's like, they didn't appreciate your masculine being like romantic or wanting to spoil them. It's like they just saw that and just was like, ooh, I want all of it. I want to just take all of it. So over time, I feel like a lot of your masculines, that energy within them was very just dead. And then you came along and now it's awakened. Okay. The big flame there in the background is a sign of that like twin flame connection here. Okay. You can't deny it. And I feel like because of the experiences that they've had in this relationship, you came into their life because they literally like pulled you in and manifested you. They kept thinking about, even though they've been with this person at night, they would always think about like, man, it would be nice to feel in love again or feel that love with someone. And this is something that they've been probably holding back from this person for a really long time. Um, Many of your masculines are craving what it feels like to be in a relationship, but not like in a relationship that seems like a contract between two people. It's like to be in a relationship with someone and actually feel in love, feel that desire, feel that passion. And you've arrived and they can't help but feel that with you, okay? Divine timing is in control here, so just let the cards fall where they may, all right? I love you guys. Take it easy and I'll catch you in the next reading, okay? Bye, guys.